Attention! Attention! Kindergarten students, it's time to learn about shapes! Alright, hi guys, welcome back. I hope you're excited about today's math lesson. So today's lesson is going to be all about shapes. Everywhere we go, we can see all the different shapes that God created. Now we already know some of these shapes. We know all of our flat 2D shapes, but we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna review them right now. All right, so I need you up on your feet. Get your body ready as we practice. Circle, never stop. Square, four sides. Triangle, three sides. Rectangle, unequal sides. Star, starlight, star bright. Oval, never stop. Diamond, rhombus. Heart, I love you. Good job. Yeah. Great job, guys, on your 2D shapes. Now I'm going to introduce some 3D shapes, okay? The first one is called a cone. A cone is something you can use to talk really loud. Or sometimes you see some cones out in our parking lot. The second 3D shape is called a sphere. A sphere is something you play out on the playground at your house. It is like a bouncy ball. The next shape is called a cylinder. A cylinder is round on the top and round on the bottom. The last 3D shape is called a cube. A cube kind of looks like a dice. So now there are some fun jingles that we want to teach you to help you remember about 3D shapes, okay? The first one is, goes like this. We're going to say a cone. A cone is like a party hat. Is like a party hat. A sphere is like a bouncy ball. A sphere is like a bouncy ball. A cylinder, a can of pop. A cylinder, a can of pop. A cube is like a dice you drop. A cube is like a dice you drop. 3D shapes are here or there. 3D shapes are here or there. 3D shapes are everywhere. 3D shapes are everywhere. Well, thank you so much for working on those guys. We hope that those jingles will help you remember our 3D shapes. So now we're gonna play a game. And we're gonna play a game with Miss Davis and Mrs. McCoy. So now I'm gonna test Mrs. McCoy. I hope I was paying attention on which shape on my table matches the 3D shape word. So I'm gonna have Mrs. McCoy pick a card, but she's not gonna look at it, only I'm gonna look at it, okay? So pick a card, pick a card. and show it to me. Okay, this is what she has, don't look. This is what she has to find on the table, okay? All right, Mrs. McCoy, All right. I want you to find the sphere. Which one? What do you think, guys? Uh, I don't know. What about this one? Yay! Good job, Mrs. McCoy. That is a sphere. Remember, a sphere is like a bouncy ball. Good job. All right. Let's pick another, another one. one. Oh, Which oh. one? Don't look, don't no look. Cheating. All right, this is the one she has to find. Okay. I want you to find, Mrs. McCoy, the cylinder. Let's cylinder. See. The cylinder. Hmm. Which one is the cylinder? Mm -hmm. I think this one. Yay! The cylinder. Good job, Mrs. McCoy. All right, two more. Let's see which card right. does she pick. Okay, don't look. Don't look. All right, this is the one she has to find. Find the cube. I know, cubes are easy. This is our cube. Good, a cube is like what? Uh, a dice you drop. Yes, a cube is like a dice you drop. Good job. All right, so now I have one shape left. Yeah. Can you remember its 3D name? Do you remember it? Oh, thanks guys for your help because now I know that this 3D shape is a 
Oh, oh good <coughs> job. Well, now that we, re we have reviewed 2D shapes and 3D shapes, we hope that you're able to uh, use the worksheet at home to remember what shapes go with 2D and 3D. So have fun with the worksheet. Let us know if you have any questions. Love you guys. Love you. Bye, guys.